Did you know that beer and cereal are actually made using the same primary ingredient? What? And today we're actually going to turn cereal into beer. Welcome to Clawhammer Supply, where we show you how to brew your very own beer, which could be anything from a light lager to a hazy IPA or even a crazy beer such as this cereal milk stout. Speaking of, the definition of the word cereal is any plant of the grass family yielding an edible grain. This includes barley, wheat, oats, rye, corn, and rice, which are all used to make beer. Have you ever had Beerios before? Cereal beer on nitro. Dude, cereal beer. You're so cereal right now. Why so cereal? Why so serious? Okay, we brewed it. Think in your mind, back to the day. Are you ready for this? To Rust? eat? Let's, let's taste a little bit of this. Yeah. What do you think? What do you think? How's it make you feel? <laughs> it's like cereal, right? It's like cereal. Yeah. Cereal grandma used to make. Cereal grain, cereal, cereal. So beer is made with cereal grains, so is cereal. It's almost as if they're made using the same stuff. Okay, ready? That's how cereal is made. Let's, let's back up. For, okay. I'll, I'll tell you, I run you through the recipe creation. Typical process, loosely managed chaos. We wanted to do an Irish stout and then we switched over to like a milk stout. Breakfast stout. Yeah, yeah, like a breakfast stout, breakfast milk stout. stout sort of, yeah. You dump, I stir? Yep. Let's mash this brew day in. Our base malt was two row yeah. pale. Mm -hmm, seven pounds. Yeah. We did a crystal 60 yep. for some residual sweetness, some unfermentable sugars. Mm -hmm. and uh, a little bit of color. A little bit of color. What did we use, a chocolate malt? Yeah. And I mean, that's where like all of yeah. that, the darkness is yeah. coming from basically. Mm -hmm. Did we use like a Munich? Was that our last? Yep, and then we did use some roasted barley. And then we doubled the flaked oat. And what we used for that was the cereal, like the carb-based cereal. This video is actually sponsored by Magic Spoon Cereal, which I'll tell you more about later. We're not going to use this cereal in our beer. Oh, this one's grain-free. Yeah, that's, we're not using that, that's why. See, this is the whole thing, Ross. We can't use Magic Spoon Cereal because it doesn't, it's grain-free. There are no grains in it. We will eat the Magic Spoon. You ready? ready? Are you ready? Are you everybody, ready? Is everybody are ready? Are you ready? Okay. Let's do it. Ready? Let's do it. So yeah, the cereal that we used is primarily oats. This is our oat slash high fructose corn syrup edition here. Who knows what else is in there? Oils, uh -huh. food coloring. Yeah. You can't legally serve this breakfast cereal in the EU. It's a war crime basically. <laughs> but fermentable, perhaps. Right. Oh, here we go. Remember that during the, the mash, it smelled horrible. It did, it, it smelled like it smelled uh, a tire fire. <laughs> it kind of yeah. smells like Malort. <laughs> if anybody's from Chicago, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> what, are, what are your expectations for this? What were you assuming was going to happen? We had kind of said, hey, this is a goofball thing. And you yeah. were like, this is gonna be the worst beer we've ever brewed. All right, so this is our first ever sponsored video, and not because this is the first time someone's asked us. The only reason I said yes to this one is because I already had a subscription to this cereal, Magic Spoon. It gets delivered to my house. Um, here's why I like it. Lawson, what? Here's why I like it so much. If you're familiar with this channel, you'll already know we brew a lot of beer. We drink a lot of beer. My carb intake, check. What I probably am lacking in, this protein. Protein. It is zero grams of sugar, only four net carbs, 13 to 14 grams of protein, only 150 calories, and it's delicious. All gains, no grains? Is that their All slogan? Gains, no grains. Are they paying me yet? <laughs> All right. Okay, hold out your bowl. Whoa! The colors. You like man. that? You like that? that? Yeah. It's gluten free, soy free, naturally flavored. I love it. I think this is my favorite. This one? Pretty, pretty kind, yeah. It's pretty good. If you want to try it out, click the link in the description, enter the code in the description for $5 off of a variety pack, or go to their website. It's magicspoon.com slash CHS5. They will give you 100% of your money back if you don't like it. It's smelling better. I think it's dissipated. It looks kind of like when you leave cereal in the bowl too long. 
That looks like cereal you'd see on a sidewalk someplace. I think the science of this is cool. So, you know, we're mashing the actual cereal in the kettle here with malted barley. The enzymes in that malted barley are turning the oats in the cereal into fermentable sugars. Like we're literally going to be converting that cereal into drinkable beer, beer, alcohol. Kyle, our 60-minute mash just ended. I think we should pull our grain basket and crank this up to a boil. How about you? That's a great idea. Let's I do it. Concur. Got it. Smells like the, the sick guitar riff in the intro to the X-Men cartoon. You know. You ready? Are we ready? You ready to do this? Do you want to do this? Here we go. <laughs> Steamy. Okay, we've jacked our power up to 100%. We're gonna ramp up to a boil. I'm just gonna tuck our hot basket in the kettle here. Pop the lid on a little bit, slight crack. Um, what are the thoughts can I impart? What else can you edit out, Lawson? Let's take a look at it. Yeah, it's dark. Yeah, it's dark. It lets no light through. Yeah. It blots out the sun. Serious midnight hooch. Yeah. For yeah. breakfast. Yeah. Ooh, dude, those smell good. Yeah, they, they do. Magnum, huh? Nice. Oh, 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 there Get it is. There. Here's the thing. Kyle doesn't want you to know this. You have to drink a beer to make beer. It's a well-known fact. I'm adding a Whirlflog tablet. This should <laughs> increase the clarity of the beer. And I'm also going to add this lactose sugar. This is non-fermentable sugar. The sugar cereal that we added earlier, that's actually gonna be converted into alcohol by the yeast. This is lactose, it's non-fermentable, so this will actually make the beer sweet. Oh yeah, we should do that as well. Hopper in the hopper. If it's in the hopper, you just don't stop it. So we're like at the end of the boil, we need to hook the chiller up now because we need to chill this wort down. Uh, we we're recirculating and uh, probably turn the uh, turn the heat off. All that like fecal looking substance, that's gonna be the cereal. Get ready to puke this up in the cutter in about two weeks. You wanna sniff it? Yeah, let's, let's sniff. sniff. Let's sniff. Get a nose in there. I mean, I get some roast, not smoke, roast. Yeah. Chocolatey vibes from that chocolate malt. It smells like a stout. Yeah. It smells like a proper stout. Dude, that is looking stout. How's it smell? A little odd. What do we got, Kyle? WLP001. No yeast starter required. Look at that. This is what the people are here for. This is the content. Oh, there you go. That's how you know you didn't get it on all the way. We're gonna put our fermenter in the cellar over here. Fermented it at 68 degrees for about 10 days. Nighty night. High fructose corn syrup, oils, uh -huh. food coloring, yeah. war crime, tire fire, malort, fecal looking substance. This is gonna be the worst beer we've ever brewed. There's only one way to find yeah, out. Yeah, we'll see. You ready? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Bottoms up, buttercup. Not only is that not bad, yeah. it's pretty good. I know. It's like really good. I know. I'm. <laughs> Very stoked. Yeah. It's a really nice, mm -hmm. like light <clears throat> stout. I wanted it to be bad. Yeah, I <laughs> yeah, know. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> you, were, you were ready. You primed my pump. You were right. like, this is gonna be trash. Yeah. I'm like, if this is trash, dude, call me Oscar the Grouch. I'm living in this <laughs> trash can. Love this. Have you ever had Beerios before? I, well, I kind of want to try that with our sponsor here, a little magic spoon. Yeah, only four carbs. You gotta add beer to this. You've heard of breakfast for dinner. This is breakfast for bar clothes. Choco. Yeah. Yeah, go, hit it. Oh yeah. I've done this, but never this like nice before. It's always been sort of bottom shelf bag cereal and malt liquor. Super Choco. Oh my God. Wow. My goal this year is to start eating healthier for lunch. I think I nailed it. Yeah. 
dude, drinking beer out of a bowl could be my new thing. <laughs> okay, tell me more. So cup is tall, right? Cup yeah. is round, but cup is tall. Okay. Okay, bowl is also round, yep. but bowl is short. Uh -huh. So instead of putting beer in cup and it tall yep. and round, yeah. you put beer in bowl and short, yep. same amount beer, uh -huh. short round. Short round? Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> game changer.